We certainly know that distracted driving leads to deadly crashes, but new numbers from federal investigators show it's not just from calling and texting. That's right. We're talking about smartphone apps that we think really help us to get places safely or actually putting lives at risk. Roseanne Aragon spoke to Tri-State drivers about their own risky behavior. We all know that calling and texting while driving is an issue, but experts say the recent increase in distracted driving is likely due to your smartphone. For example, I can open up Snapchat and record just how fast this car is going. But right now, I'm the passenger. What happens if I'm the driver? Distracted driving. It happens. Are you guilty of driving distracted? Yeah. Oh, absolutely. I guess we all are at some point. They're not alone. A recent study from the National Highway Traffic Safety Administration shows the largest increase in highway fatalities in 50 years. And it's even worse this year. The first six months, U.S. highway deaths jumped 10.4 percent. Notable reason, experts say smartphone apps. What apps do you use? Pokemon Go. <laughs> Music apps. The younger generation has to have so many of these toys. Studies show Snapchat, Google Maps, Pokemon Go, Waze, and Netflix are listed as some of the most commonly used apps while driving. Granted, many of these apps tell you to only update or use if you're a passenger, but is there a temptation to just pick up the phone? These new apps may be convenient and easy to use, but they're not meant to use while you're behind the wheel. It's definitely not smart usage of your smartphone. AAA says here in the tri-state they're expecting the most traveled Thanksgiving holiday in nine years. And with thousands expected to take to the roads, safety is put into perspective. Yeah, it means a heck of a lot to me. I, I, I think a lot about every time I get on the expressway, I'm a little bit nervous. I would never forgive myself if I was Snapchatting and I hit someone. Now, most new cars today have software that connects to smartphones and allows people to make calls, dictate texts, and use apps hands-free. Now, if you don't have one of those cars, you can do yourself a favor and get yourself a phone bracket in case you want to use those apps. Reporting Roseanne Aragon, 9 on your side.